One of the most comprehensive muscle builders on the planet that's not hormonal. It's not a pro hormone, it's not a song, it's not, you know, uh, some bullshit claim that you find out there in terms of muscle builders. Welcome inside the fitnessperformance.com HQ. I'm that by founder and CEO today with another 100% honest, no bullshit supplement review. This time we are looking at Ghost Size V2 Muscle Builder. V2 meaning it's the second iteration of the popular muscle building supplement from one of the hottest brands in sports nutrition in Ghost. Today we're going to talk about this product on five categories. First we're going to talk about the ingredient profile. Second we're going to talk about the effectiveness. Third, we're going to talk about flavor. Fourth, mixability as well. I'll show you a mixability test here on camera. And then finally, we're going to talk about value on Ghost size. So let's dive into this right away. So what are some changes that Ghost made from V1 to V2? That's a pretty typical and I would say uh, uh, popular question, right? The first thing is, and the most important thing is, they went from a multi-source creatine, so creatine monohydrate, and I believe it was creatine HCL or hydrochloride, to a single source creatine and creapure creatine monohydrate at five grams. Why the change? Well, for it, for starters, creatine monohydrate is the most well-studied, proven ingredient in sports nutrition right alongside caffeine. Now, we say that the typical dosage of creatine monohydrate should be at five grams per day. You're getting five grams of creatine monohydrate here, but here's where they take it a step further. They use creapure. What does that mean or why is that important? Creapure is a 99.9% .9 purity, meaning that you're going to get actually five grams of creatine per serving like you're supposed to versus maybe some creatine that might come from China or other that doesn't have 100% purity, your five grams that you're taking may only yield X in terms of creatine. So you get the um, you get the personal satisfaction, the guarantee from creatine that you're actually eating five grams of creatine monohydrate. This is also cool, it includes beta alanine at 3.2 grams. Now beta alanine is the green, you find a lot of pre-workout, it provides you or gives a lot of people the tingles. So some people don't like it and that's okay. We're gonna address that here in a second, but beta alanine is an amazing ingredient that should be used daily to reach saturation point. It should be used only on pre-workout days or days that you take a pre-workout. 3.2 to 6.4 grams per day. You're getting 3.2 grams here. Now, for those of you who don't like the tingles, this actually utilizes 400 milligrams of beta prime, which is gonna reduce the tingles from the beta alanine to the point where they're basically non-existent. Now, I don't necessarily get a lot of tingles from beta alanine, so I've never experienced it, but my wife who does, didn't get the tingles like she normally would with a pre-workout. Betaine used at 2,500 milligrams. Now, this is another cool ingredient that you'll find in some pre-workouts. Betaine has a plethora of benefits, most importantly, with strength output. So you're looking at a muscle builder like Go Size. You want that strength output so you can help uh, tear down the muscle to rebuild it to rebuild itself in a bigger, better way. It also has muscle recovery benefits at 2,500 milligrams. We also have epicatechin at 200 milligrams. Now, there's a lot of contradicting studies on epicatechin. Um, some saying that it actually inhibits myostatin, others saying it doesn't, or ones that are validifying that saying it might not. Myostatin is the growth factor that regulates muscle size, meaning that it tells your body not to get too big. This starts at birth because your muscles need to be obviously uh, within the realm of what your body can handle. Now, we've all seen the images of like the cattle and cows who are absolutely massive. Well, they don't have a myostatin system in place. So myostatin is actually inhibited by epicatechin, which is used at 200 milligrams here. So it's not going to hurt to be in here. If anything, if it validifies uh, the studies are validified, then epicatechin here, which is a myostatin inhibitor, is going to help you actually grow beyond the boundaries of what your body says you should be at. Now, it's not going to happen like steroids or SARMs or pro hormones or anything of that nature. So obviously be realistic about it, but that's what the use of it is. Synactive used at 50 milligrams. Synactive from New Live Science is a really cool, unique ingredient that helps replenish ATP production similar to what creatine monohydrate does, which is going to help you give um, you know, more energy in the gym. It also uh, revitalizes muscular cells. So it removes old muscular, unhealthy muscular cells and replaces them with new healthy muscular cells. So you're going to have yourself the benefit of prolonged uh, exercise quality from Synactive as well as muscular recovery. And then lastly, estrogen at 50 milligrams. One of the most comprehensive muscle builders on the planet that's non-hormonal. It's not a pro-hormone, it's not a SARMs, it's not you know uh, some bullshit claim that you find out there in terms of muscle builders. It's a straightforward ingredient using safe, effective, the Shea ingredients, which is what you want, especially if you're like a tested athlete. You don't wanna be using some of the other bullshit that's out there. Go size will obviously pass all the tests. Effectiveness, now here's the thing. 
You're not going to take a tub of ghost size and experience 10 pounds of lean mass gain in a month. It's just not going to happen. They're not going to make erroneous claims like pearl hormones and SARMs. But what's going to happen is you don't get the discomfort in the stomach that some creatines give you. You don't get the creatine bloat per se, although you do experience a better pump. Seemingly, it seems like your output does increase in the gym. Now, that can depend on a bunch of different factors, pre-workouts, meal timing, meals, etc. But on go size, it seems like there are better workouts, more output, and better recovery. So that's our personal experience, and that's kind of a similar experience that we get if we, you know, supplement separately with creatine, betaine, beta alanine, etc. But you get it all here in one product. So overall, is it effective? The answer is absolutely yes. In terms of taste, this is lime. This is one of the most spot-on lime flavors that I have had in a powdered form in sports nutrition, whether it be a creatine product like this or a muscle building product like this, a pre-workout, an intra-workout. Big fan of lime, so I did like this. It's very strong lime flavor. It's tart, so if you're not a fan of that, then this may not be for you. They have other flavors for you to try, but I was a huge fan of lime. It was something different, refreshing, and absolutely delicious. In terms of mixability, here it is. These ingredients aren't going to be 100% soluble in water. So we mix it up here in 8 ounces of water. In the official Shaker Cup of Fitness Informant, the Ice Shaker Cup, we utilized one scoop. And again, we follow directions to a T. Um, you see it does mix, but you're going to see quite a bit of particles floating in here. And actually, as you get to the bottom of that ghost glass here that you're seeing, uh, there was quite a bit of residue sitting at the bottom. So again, it doesn't deter me from using this because I like to drink my stuff quickly. But it's not the best in terms of mixability. It's going to have residue. And that actually, guys and girls, it's okay. In terms of value, 30 servings for 40 bucks at Ghost website. Some people might be like, hey, that's expensive. I can buy a creatine monohydrate like 5,000 milligrams for like 20 bucks. Yes, you can. But then you need to buy beta alanine. And then you need to go out and buy betaine. You need to go out and buy epicadogen. You need to go out and buy synactive. So in terms of an all-encompassing formula at $40 price tag, it's a great deal for you guys. Now, here's the cool thing. Use promo code INFORMANT, save 20%. It's going to knock off 8 bucks, making this 30 servings for 32 bucks, just north of a dollar a serving for a high-quality branded creatine, beta, beta alanine with reduced tingles and beta prime. You're also going to get epicadogen. You're going to get synactive. You're going to get betaine. Great value at 32 bucks with promo code INFORMANT. There you go. If you want to read this whole in-depth review, head over to fitnessinformant.com or use the link below here in the description box. If you want to buy this from ghostlifestyle.com, use that promo code INFORMANT. Save 20%. It is listed below along with a link to take the purchase. Make sure you follow us on our social media channels. We're on Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. Subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the red subscribe now button here below to stay up with all new supplement reviews, rankings, all that awesome stuff right here at our YouTube channel. Make sure you check out our podcast. It's called the Iron Union Podcast here on YouTube, Spotify, iTunes, and all major podcast platforms. And for more supplement reviews, rankings, news deals, workout routines, and nutrition plans, visit us on our official website, online at fitnessinformance.com.